A journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. And so it is with the extraordinary journey of pregnancy. A journey that begins with the magical moment of conception. It's a time of wonder, where two tiny cells, a sperm and an egg, unite to create a new life. This microscopic meeting ignites a chain reaction, a symphony of biological processes that will unfold over the next nine months. Imagine a single sperm on its mission, navigating the fluid landscape of the woman's body, finally reaching the egg, a tiny beacon of life. This union, this fusion of two cells, marks the beginning of something truly miraculous. The fertilized egg, now called a zygote, carries within it the blueprint of a brand new human being. This cluster of cells, now known as a blastocyst, eventually implants itself in the lining of the uterus like a seed finding its home in fertile ground. The first whispers of a new life often come in subtle ways. For some women it's a missed period that first raises a flag. For others it's the emergence of tender, swollen breasts, a heightened sense of smell or an unusual aversion to certain foods or smells. These early signs are all thanks to the surge of hormones, particularly human chorionic gonadotropin, or HCG, flooding the body. Fatigue is a common companion in these early weeks as the body works tirelessly behind the scenes. Frequent urination becomes the norm as the growing uterus puts pressure on the bladder. Morning sickness, despite its name, can strike at any time of day or night. The best way to confirm a pregnancy is with a home pregnancy test, which detects the presence of HCG in the urine. The first trimester, spanning from week 1 to week 12, is a time of incredible transformation. The tiny embryo, nestled within the cosy walls of the uterus, is growing at an astonishing rate developing from a cluster of cells into a recognizable human form. This is the time when the baby's essential organs, the heart, lungs, liver, kidneys, and brain, begin to form. The neural tube, which will later develop into the baby's brain and spinal cord, closes. Tiny buds sprout, soon to become arms and legs. It's a period of rapid development, laying the foundation for all that's to come. Hormonal fluctuations can lead to mood swings, fatigue and nausea. The breasts may become larger and more sensitive, and food cravings or aversions are common. Eating a healthy diet rich in fruits, vegetables and whole grains is crucial for both the mother's and baby's well-being. As the curtain rises on the second trimester, many women breathe a sigh of relief as early discomforts ease. The second trimester, spanning weeks 13 to 28, is often called the honeymoon phase. Energy levels rebound and nausea and fatigue often subside. Meanwhile, the baby continues to grow steadily. Bones harden and the baby's skin is covered in fine, downy hair called lanugo. One magical milestone is feeling the baby's first movements, known as quickening. These early flutters, like butterflies or gas bubbles, show the baby is thriving. An ultrasound around week 20 provides a detailed look at the baby, revealing their sex if parents choose. It's a time to marvel at the miracle unfolding within and connect with the little one growing stronger each day. Section 5. The home stretch, the third trimester. The third trimester, from week 29 to week 40, marks the final stretch of this incredible journey. The baby continues to grow and mature, preparing for life outside the womb. Their lungs are developing and they're gaining weight rapidly, adding layers of fat that will help regulate their body temperature after birth. The growing baby puts pressure on the bladder, leading to more frequent urination. The expanding uterus can also cause backaches, heartburn, and shortness of breath. As the due date approaches, the baby will typically settle into a head-down position in preparation for birth. The third trimester is a time for nesting, preparing the home for the baby's arrival, 
packing a hospital bag, and attending childbirth classes. As the due date draws near, excitement and anticipation build, mingled with a touch of bittersweetness as the journey of pregnancy nears its end. Section 6, Preparing for Parenthood, A Journey of Togetherness. Pregnancy is not just a physical journey, it's a deeply emotional and spiritual one as well. It's a time of profound change, both for the expectant mother and her partner. As the baby grows, so too does the bond between the parents as they navigate this new chapter together. Attending prenatal appointments as a couple allows both parents to be involved in the pregnancy and to ask questions. Pregnancy can be a time of heightened emotions, and it's important for partners to communicate openly and support each other. Attending childbirth classes together can help prepare both parents for labor, delivery, and the early days of parenthood. Setting up the nursery, choosing baby clothes, and installing the car seat are all tangible reminders that a new life is about to enter the world. Open communication and a willingness to support each other are key to navigating the challenges and joys of parenthood together. Section seven, nourishing your body Nurturing your baby. Tips for a healthy pregnancy. Pregnancy is a time to nourish your body from the inside out. What you eat and drink directly affects the health and development of your growing baby. Eat a balanced diet. Focus on fruits, vegetables, whole grains, lean protein, and low fat dairy products. Stay hydrated. Drink plenty of water throughout the day. Water is essential for cell growth and helps prevent constipation, a common pregnancy complaint. Take a prenatal vitamin. Prenatal vitamins contain essential nutrients such as folic acid and iron that support your baby's development. Avoid raw or undercooked foods. These foods may contain bacteria that can cause food poisoning which can be dangerous during pregnancy. Get regular exercise. Moderate exercise, such as walking, swimming, or prenatal yoga, can help improve circulation, boost mood, and prepare your body for labor. Section eight, the emotional roller coaster navigating the ups and downs. Pregnancy is an emotional roller coaster. One minute you're over the moon with joy, the next you're overcome with anxiety. Hormonal fluctuations, physical changes, and the anticipation of parenthood can all contribute to mood swings and emotional ups and downs. It's important to acknowledge and accept these emotions as a normal part of pregnancy. Don't be afraid to talk about how you're feeling with your partner, family, or friends. Sharing your experiences with others who understand can help you feel less alone. Engaging in activities that bring you joy can also help boost your mood. Remember, you're not alone in this journey. Section 9. Building your support system. You are not alone. Pregnancy is not a journey you have to take alone. Building a strong support system is crucial for navigating the physical and emotional challenges of pregnancy and parenthood. Your partner, family, and friends can provide invaluable support during this time. They can offer a listening ear, a shoulder to cry on, or a helping hand when you need it most. Don't be afraid to ask for help with errands, chores, or childcare. Prenatal classes are a great way to connect with other expectant parents and learn from experienced educators. Online communities and support groups can also provide a sense of connection and support. Surround yourself with people who love and support you, and don't hesitate to reach out for help when you need it. Section 10. Welcoming your little miracle, the joy of birth. After nine months of anticipation, the day finally arrives, the day your little miracle enters the world. Labor and delivery are unique experiences, but the love and joy when you hold your newborn is universal. 
whether vaginally or via caesarean, birth is powerful and transformative. It's the culmination of an incredible journey marking the start of parenthood. As you gaze into your baby's eyes, you'll feel a love like never before. This tiny human nurtured and carried for so long is finally here.